An important term to learn when you are learning how to program is what's called side effects. A side effect is something that changes the state of the computer or your program uh, beyond just giving back a value. Now, when we talked about functions, we've said that it's best if your functions simply calculate a value, they don't read anything from input, they don't print anything from output, they do a calculation, and they give you back the result. Such functions generally do not have any side effects. They don't change anything as they are happening because they don't read, because they don't print. They also never assign to external vars. So you can't tell the difference before the function has occurred and after the function has occurred because nothing has been altered on the computer. These are the most generally useful types of functions, but you're going to write others at, at various times. Uh, and it's worth introducing the concept of a procedure, which would be a function that you create simply because of its side effects. In many languages, they actually have a separate syntax for procedures. In Scala, a procedure would typically be denoted by the fact that it returns unit. So we're going to write a little function here called greet. And this function has no purpose other than to print something for us. Okay, we enter a name, and it's just going to print out hello, and then that name. OK. Very simple function. All that it does is side effects. It doesn't calculate anything for us. It doesn't give us back any value. We can't do more with it. It is intended just to have a particular output to it. And so when you see something that returns unit, because it's not giving you back a value, this indicates that the only reason you would call it is for the side effects that it has, whether those side effects are printing things or doing assignments to vowels, possibly even reading things in if you just wanted to skip stuff from the input. A lot of times, though, functions that are written specifically to read stuff from input will also return values for that. Uh, but just so you're aware, these types of functions are often called procedures in other languages. And the idea of having something that actually changes values is referred to as a side effect. We will often try to write our programs in ways that are side effect free, okay, so that we will only do side effects when absolutely needed. When you write a script, turns out if you don't have a side effect someplace, it's not doing anything. You have to at least print a result for it to be useful to a user. If you don't print anything, the user has you know, no indication uh, that anything even happened when you ran this. So you aren't avoiding side effects completely, but you are trying to make it so that the side effects kind of happen at the highest level in your program, and that the majority of the logic that goes on in your program is side effect free.